Hi, welcome to ESS with SpaceMax. This talk is part of the Emacs Speaks Statistics introduction series designed to help you get started with ESS and Emacs. Today we'll be looking at what SpaceMax is and why you should care, and how you can get started with SpaceMax. What is SpaceMax? SpaceMax is a configuration starter kit for Emacs. This means that it provides some sane default settings so that you can get a nice Emacs out of the box. Uh, the internet is full of Emacs configuration starter kits, so why should you consider this one? Well, that's because it's designed uh, consistently using four core pillars. These are that the design should be mnemonic and discoverable, consistent and crowd configured. Mnemonic and discoverable means that the key bindings and functionality provided by the configuration are easy to remember and easy to find. For example, space F is the prefix for all key bindings related to file management. You might use space FF to launch the find file command. Similarly, space M is the prefix for all commands related to the current major mode. For example, if you were editing some R code, space msb launches the command to send the current buffer to the REPL. Similarly, there is space W, B and G for window management, buffer management and interacting with Git. Having these mnemonic uh, key bindings means that it's very easy to remember key bindings even if you don't use them very frequently and it makes it possible to discover ones by just typing and seeing what pops up. The design is consistent. Um, so packages are organized into layers and there's one layer for each language and the bindings across languages are incredibly similar. This is really useful if you work on multiple projects and you might need to jump between languages uh, across projects. Finally, the design is crowd configured. No one has time to write a perfect Emacs configuration. So by uh, allowing everyone to contribute on GitHub, you end up with a really fine tuned configuration uh, with far more detail than any one person could put together. So hopefully now you're convinced that SpaceMax might be worth giving a try. Um, how do you get started? Well, spoiler alert, it works right out of the box. You just need to download SpaceMax from GitHub and restart Emacs and uh, there's a startup wizard that takes care of the rest. Um, for instructions more specific to using ESS, I've written a little guide and that's included in the repository associated with this talk. Uh, there should be a link in the, in the uh, description somewhere. Okay, if you're interested in learning a bit more about SpaceMax, um, there's a website for the project. Um, all the development is done on GitHub, so you can inspect the code there. Uh, that's where you get download the actual configuration, and you can see a list of current issues and who's working on what. If you'd like to speak to current users, there's a Gitter channel, um, and there's even a subreddit. So I hope this has been useful. Um, if you're looking for a no fuss way to get a really nice SpaceMax Emacs configuration out of the box, then SpaceMax might be the solution for you. Thanks.